13th of October, Beachy Head, lines 75 through 99. For now the sun is verging to the sea, and as he westward sinks, the floating clouds, suspended, move upon the evening gale, and gathering round his orb, as if to shade the insufferable brightness, they resign their gauzy whiteness, and more warmed, assume all hues of purple. Their transparent gold mingles with ruby tints and sapphire gleams, and colors such as nature through her works shows only in the ethereal canopy. Thither aspiring, fancy fondly soars, wandering sublime through visionary veils, where bright pavilions rise, and trophies fanned by airs celestial, and adorned with wreaths of flowers that bloom amid Elysian bowers. Now bright, and brighter still the colors glow, Till half the lustrous orb within the flood Seems to retire, the flood reflecting still its splendor, And in mimic glory dressed, Till the last ray shot upward fires the clouds with blazing crimson. Then in paler light, Long lines of tenderer radiance lingering yield to partial darkness, and on the opposing side the early moon distinctly rising throws her pearly brilliance on the trembling tide. Charlotte Smith, 1749 through 1806.